section 1 exercise 5 it says device is circuit when i 0.0, .0 is on this is the first input q 0.0, .0 should be on first output should be on and q 0.0, .0 should be off the second output should be off so using one input one output should be on another output should be off but when input is off q 0.0, .0 .1 should be on so the one which was off gets on and the one which was on gets off so it's like alternating the output using one input you are controlling two outputs in alternate ways so what does it mean now initially if this is off this should be on and this is off if I turn it on this goes on and this goes off so I don't need this this switch here I can remove that so that it will be pretty easy for you to understand what I'm saying so initially what it says when this button is off this is off so this output is following this button but this is the reversal of what is happening to this output so if this is off this is off but this is on if this is on this goes on and this goes off this is what we have to make it's pretty simple all you have to do is take the input give the address i0.0 .0, my first button oops sorry again i0.0 .0, using that we need to take the first output in the just like that okay single input at output q0.0 .0. this goes on so if this goes on this will be on but this will be off how to do that how to make sure this is off but when this goes on this should be on so this is the reverse or the inverse of what is happening to this to this output or to this button so what we can take is we can take another network we cannot make logic here this is the condition in Siemens when you are making a logic in one network you can only write this one or you can connect in parallel or in series but if you have another another let's say another letter you cannot write that here you have to write it here this is a principle so I'll take in this case NC of this input NC because the another output is inverse of my first output you can also take NC of this output this will also make sense here I'll take Q0.1 so what does it mean let me download and show you what exactly gonna happen in this logic so to download I'll press download and here instead of push button I'm going to use it as alternate let me just change its configuration I need to go maximize oh yeah this is alternate go to run mode press yes and here I'll go online play so initially you can see that when this is off this is on okay and this is on because this is NC and this is NO this has not actuated by I0.0 .0. that's why this is false but its inverse is true that's why the output is on so what's gonna happen if I turn on this input this letter will be true this will be false this is inverse so if this is true this will be false this is the inverse of the status of I0.0 .0. if this is true this will be true so this is on if this is true this will be false so this is off so that's alternating the output using one input okay I hope this makes sense so this with this exercise our first section is complete you can try this section in your in your software or uh, if you have any doubt you can put me a comment the next exercise will proceed to section 2 thank you so much